Last year it was tomatoes. This year it's peppers. Melissa Emerson's garden has to be picture perfect. It's where she and her husband grow and photograph plants to advertise their seed company. We start planning in January for the catalog that gets released in November. The company does its retail online, but it's marketing the old-fashioned way. Most of our customers get the catalog, they flip through it, they mark it up, and then they go to their website and they order online. Their catalogs are printed at Dingley Press in Lisbon, Maine, where the digital age hasn't hurt business, it's helped. And the market's doing well. VP Jim Gibbs says many of his clients are strictly online. They can only grow their business to a certain point where they need to reach new prospects, and they're turning to catalogs to generate prospects. An industry trade group says by its latest count, more than 13 billion catalogs a year are moving through the mail. The customer it brings is really the holy grail of customers because they're actually a customer of your business and they tend to make repeat purchases. Atlanta's Onward Reserve clothing retailer says the printed page creates a more personal touch. We've got a, a true connection with our customers and, and a big part of driving that is our catalogs. Emerson packs her catalogs with personal stories from her garden. Where would your company be without this catalog? Uh, we wouldn't be a company without this catalog. It's the driving force behind everything we do. And a survivor of the digital revolution. Kenneth Craig, CBS News, Lisbon, Maine.